Now you made it to the end of the work week. We want to take you outside here. A live look at Lake Norman. The colors in the sunrise just bouncing off the water. It doesn't get much better than that. Although we would take uh, lower rain chances for the weekend, Ted. Yeah, we certainly will. But then our rain, our rain chances would be diminished. And of course, the beautiful sunrises wouldn't look as vibrant as they are. We're seeing from Lake Norman over to Uptown, a reminder of just how beautiful the area is that we live in. 70 degrees as you get your morning started. 75 with winds coming out of the south at 6 miles per hour. You're looking at mid-70s for Charlotte, Monroe, into Lancaster. Upper 70 towards Wagebro and Tra. Upper 60s, Boone and Jefferson still feeling uh, those warm conditions up towards our mountain counties. Highs today get on the hot side. We're talking about highs in the mid 90s for Charlotte, Monroe, M Wagebro, out towards Rockingham, upper 90s towards Shra and Lancaster, while we're in the upper 70s to near 80 degrees for the higher elevations. Taking a look at the big picture, we have to go all the way out to Dallas to find the triple digits. We're going to feel like the triple digits close to home, going with a high of 96, 93 towards Charleston. But notice we're at 83 for at Nashville, 88 Little Rock and 85 Oklahoma City, a stark drop off in the temperatures from the triple digits to the 80s over here. Now we have the 80s in store, but this front, this cold front that leaks down into the Carolinas also lines up where the showers peak from northern Texas and the Oklahoma stretching all the way through Tennessee up towards parts of Kentucky and West Virginia. They're still seeing some of those flood concerns for today. We also have our rain chances heading into your afternoon. Taking a look right now, this is how things pan out. We start off mostly dry with those early morning showers tapering off. Afternoon and evening storms along that I-40 corridor leaking south towards the Queen City into tonight before it tapers off. A dry start to your Saturday, then Saturday afternoon, 3 o'clock, 345. Isolated storms start to develop yet again. Time to pack up at the pool. And of course, you see the storms that bubble up right around that 7, 745 hour for folks that are heading out to Charlotte FC. Make sure you bring that poncho. Rain and storms taper off overnight into your Sunday, we have more in the way of a marginal risk for severe weather with the damaging winds possible. Also, an abundant amount of rain, upwards to an inch of rain where the heavy downpour set. Highs in the 90s, overnight lows in the 70s. We'll get a bit of relief from the heat throughout the weekend with storm chances increasing.